Hello everybody, how y'all doing? Well, they finally got this one working again and it is changing as you can see. And that's a good thing because now we can see the upper part of the dam, which we hadn't been able to see lately. And you can see that they're still working quite severely. They're working on this thing quite a lot. Sorry about the little interruption. Uh, Pop Belly got a little close to one of the puppies and he was in his cage. He hadn't got out yet. And he was showing his discomfort. But anyway, as you see, guys, but, oh. but anyway, again, another interruption. Uh, trying to get this done because it's kind of late. And I'm got to work, so I'm trying to get her done. And of course, they want to play and jump around and this, that, and another. But as you can tell, there's not a whole lot of nothing new going on other than it looks as if they got a whole lot better camera than they have been having. But anyway looks like they're still doing a little bit of drilling up here and they have been knocking a lot of stuff down up there too so <coughs> they have definitely been doing some drilling and some blasting up there although they're not letting us I guess you have to sit here all day long to see the blasting anymore I ain't been able to catch none lately been hoping to but I just ain't caught none but as you can see, they've been knocking this down right through here. Just moments ago, they had a bulldozer up there and a backhoe up here. I guess they're getting ready to knock off or change shifts or something right now. Which is probably what's going on. They didn't quite get to turn it on quick enough. But as you can see, it's uh, definitely changing a lot wow but that's enough of that um, let's see what else we got going on here well over here with our frequency rings we're gonna go back to some more of the other here in a minute but figured it was a little time to do a little bit of the frequency rings got one one there got another one there we got two over here got one right there another one there one here one coming out of there that one Got one here, here, there, so we got a total of 13 frequency rings going on at the present time, and they're quite, quite a bit of them all over the country, so there you go. Normal is as normal does, right? And I figured we'd come over here and do a little checking up on this. See what's going on. And as you can tell, 6.5 TeV. And they are colliding. There's some collisions going on. Even though they got this one turned off. Well, that's a little odd. Huh. Everything's out and undefined, really. But this one right here is showing you what's going on. And as you can tell, these have changed. Changed again from this point 
either. And it just changed again, so let's check it. It ain't time to for it to change. We've got a few more seconds here. See what happens. Come on, anytime soon. And here we go. Oh, and it didn't change again. Oh, there it goes. A few seconds late there, guys. We can check this one. And you can see they're definitely colliding. Of course, this one. Definitely see that they're doing something. Now we know that that's running. We also know that our earthquakes are going in this, that, and another. And for those of you that don't know or haven't figured it out yet or don't know or whatever the case may be, they're about 20 miles from the Orville Dam. They're having, they've got a dry spot that is caught on fire and is burning. And they calling it uh, the wall fire. And there's the little bit of an update. I'll put the link in here in the below section for you. So you can come here and read the whole thing. This page is quite long. It goes a long time. I mean, there's a lot of different updates. As you can tell it goes a long ways down. It shows you about the fire, There's a couple of videos in here, and it tells you when it started, the whole nine yards, it gives you all the updates. So you can come here and read it all for yourself to see what's going on with the fire. We did get a few photos today, so I think there's about 16 here, so we'll, maybe 17, let's see. Okay, there was one more back check it out yeah that's the old one okay as you can tell that the water level is down far enough now that it's not even reaching it's pretty much not even reaching the spillway anymore it's uh it's down there i mean it's there you, you know there could be a little bit of water come out but it's not to say much okay it wouldn't last very long if they opened it all the way up anyway. It'd run out and be gone. And as you see, they're still showing, they're laying the stuff down in front of the emergency spillway, getting it ready to do what they promised everyone they were doing. And that's just another crane, it looks like. And then they're showing you what they're doing and how they're doing it. Well, they sure got a lot of equipment there for that. And they're still digging out the, the river itself. And there we're laying boards down on top of the stuff to keep the concrete cool. Got some beautiful shots on some of this stuff, guys. That's for sure. Man. Now I'm curious. Uh, that's that right there is just to me just totally weird. That's some big ass pipe, and it's plastic. That's just totally bizarre. Got to think about that a little bit. It's a 
big old vacuum cleaner over there. Well, guys, I've about seen it all. Now we got one more to go. And well, like I said earlier, they're still blasting over there. And here's another one. This is where I told you they were bulldozing earlier. They were bulldozing down over here in this area. And it looks like they just caused that to completely cave on in. They're going to bring this down even more, it looks like. But folks, you see it for yourself, what's going on. So, you do know that they're still blasting. They probably blast, and if I'd have been home, they wouldn't have recorded for me anyway, because something would have had to went wrong, just the way it is. But anyway, folks, if you like my stuff, please subscribe to the channel. Hit the subscribe button. Next to the subscribe button is a little gearbox. Hit the gearbox. Hit the little check mark for my feed to come to you. And your bell should light up like this. Make sure you do it more than once to make sure you stay subscribed. Log off to another channel and come back and make sure to see that you're still subscribed. Do it more than once. Make sure that you're subscribed because if you don't, I know for a fact they unsubscribe people, and y'all do too. So with that from my cold, dead hands, I abolish corporate government for your freedoms. Much love to y'all. Y'all have a good night now, you hear?